Yo, this is Tofester Baloney. I'm thinking about making a movie on the Armenian genocide, specifically the novel The Forty Days of Musa, uh, whatever. It's, a, it's about history. And the Turkish deniers say, what's the evidence that the Turks exterminated Armenians? They say Turks and Armenians lived peacefully for centuries, so what the fuck? Well, I did my research, and I'm going to show you the evidence. Not that we need much, because they're Turks, the Muslims, and everybody knows they love to kill poor, unarmed, innocent Christians, and what more do you need to know? But, okay, the evidence. Like this guy, Lord Bryce. He was a lord, like me, I was a lord of Flatbush. And lords don't lie. He said 800,000 Armenians were killed by the Turks. I don't know how he knew that, because he was in England at the time, but it was printed in the New York Times, so you know it's got to be true. His assistant, Arnold Toynbee, wrote the Blue Book, which he said was entirely based on missionary and Armenian testimony. And what more do you need? God-fearing missionaries and Armenians don't lie. Then we got Britain, Russia, and France fighting the Turks, and they issued a May 1915 declaration that Turkey had better cut it out with the killing, otherwise they'd pay. That's proof right there. It's not like Britain, Russia, and France were planning to divide Turkey between themselves, and they had ulterior motives or nothing like that. Then we had Ambassador Morgenthau and his consuls. Okay, they never witnessed nothing firsthand, like massacres, and they got their information from Armenians and missionaries, like Morgenthau had this guy, Andonian, and this guy, Shmavo, Shmo, well, whatever. And you know they ain't gonna lie. American diplomats always tell the truth. Then we got fantastic Armenian scholars like this guy, Dadrian. Yo, Dadrian! <laughs> I like this guy already. And he gave proof positive, like in 1919, the Turks prosecuted Turks for genocide. The Brits told them they had it, otherwise they'd be in for it at the peace conference. So even though the original court records don't exist, we know they did a great job. It was like when we went in Iraq and set up a government there. It's not like they would do anything we were going to tell them, right? And finally, we have the personal opinions of genocide scholars like Gregory Stanton and Israel Chani. They're not going to lie, because, hey, they're against genocide, so they're real honorable. As we all know from my first Rambo movie, anyone who fires the first shot is guilty, and the barbaric Turks obviously had it in for the Armenians, and they couldn't even do a good job, because... Most Armenians survived. As I said in First Blood. They drew First Blood, not me. They push him, they push him, and they push him. And finally, he pushes back. 